Groups are small squares or triangles that appear in objects you select. In this example on the rectangle, I select the rectangle and the groups appear. I select the bottom left hand corner as the hot grip. The stretch command is the default and I can change the geometry. Let's undo that. Select the rectangle again, but this time select the middle as the hot grip. Notice the change in geometry is somewhat different. Undo that again. As well as the stretch command, other commands are available. Let's have a look at those. Select the rectangle, hot grip. This time we right click and we see that move, rotate, scale, mirror and copy are all available. Let's move the rectangle, simply drag it to a new position. The rectangle displayed eight grips. Let's have a look at other geometry and see what happens. We're going to start by selecting a circle, an arc, a polyline, and a spline. Note also that by holding down the shift key you can select multiple hot grips. In the options dialog box on the selection tab you can vary the grip size. You can also change the grip colors. The defaults are blue and red. And there are some other options underneath grips that you can change.